Here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. After a bit of partial sun this morning, uh, light rain starting to work in right now. It will pick up in intensity along with increasing wind. And we're talking about wet weather that should extend right on through tomorrow night. So kind of a, uh, a long road ahead as far as uh, dreary conditions. Take a look at Newport, cloudy skies. Visibility is pretty good just for the simple fact that the rain that's coming through right now is very light and scattered. But it will be picking up and the wind picking up as well, especially uh, along the coastline. We don't have any wind watches or warnings for for our coastal waters as far as a high wind advisory or a, a warning, but we do have small craft and gale warning. So it will be picking up Oaken Beach in Warwick now coming in at the 49 degrees with us some light showers coming in. So tracking this ocean storm, which is backing in, moving in reverse. So normally they would essentially move from west, from the west to east. This one's moving in reverse now through Friday with the rain and the wind. It still dries out for the weekend. So we're still feeling optimistic about both Saturday and Sunday. That's not to say that we have sunshine and 60 coming up this weekend, but We'll see some slow partial clearing on Saturday. At least it's drier, but it's pretty cool. A little milder coming up on Sunday before we start to see temperatures a little more respectable, a little warmer by uh, early next week. You see the rain, all this green coming in uh, from off the coast of Boston and through down East Maine, tracking off uh, to the uh, south and west and overspreading uh, westerly uh, shortly. It's already raining in New Bedford. And look at this huge shield of moisture from down East Maine. It's all associated with this swirl offshore. Pretty impressive. A uh, tight, compact storm system. You can see that counterclockwise twirl right in there. And this is throwing back that Atlantic moisture. So rather than kind of scooting out to sea, it's going to back up and move in reverse. So we take a look at the forecast. And notice this evening and overnight, there it goes, edging closer. And then what it will do is a loop. It'll drop off to the south. Now, this is Friday morning, rain and wind. And then it slowly drops to the south Friday night, but still throwing back a shield of wet weather even into Friday evening and Friday night. Get a close up look, see how it all plays out here. And you can see the precipitation, just bands of green coming in off the ocean, the areas of yellow and orange, you get a downpour every now and then. So if it's not a heavy rain, it's a drizzle, but it's wet weather. Eight o'clock in the morning in the mid 40s and no change here. Mid 40s in the afternoon, rain still coming in off the ocean. Six o'clock in the evening, windy and wet right on through tomorrow night at 11 o'clock with a windswept rain and temperatures in the lower 40s. No coastal flood warning for Rhode Island, but it is for east coastal Massachusetts, Cape and the Islands, Plymouth County. This would be for Friday morning. And now it'll be windy everywhere on Friday, but the strongest winds will be confined to east coastal Mass. High wind advisory here, high wind warning for the Cape. The strongest winds on the outer Cape could be in the order of 50 to 60 miles per hour in gusts. So it's a windswept rain for tomorrow morning. Now these are sustained winds, not gusts. North, northeast, 2025, but will be gusts. 30 40. Same situation Friday afternoon. A windswept rain, chilly north northeast, sustained at 2025, and still a gust of 30 to 40. Seven day forecast looking at some better weather on Saturday. Uh, it's mainly cloudy. I think if you get any breaks of sun, it would be later in the afternoon, but at least it's dry, it's cool. Some splashes of sunshine, cool, dry for Sunday, a little milder, 54. Look at the uh, Monday and Tuesday, that's more like it. Upper 50s to lower 60s with a mix of clouds and some sunshine. But now through at least Friday night, the wet weather and the windy weather will continue.